How you guys doing? And what is the record in reverence to Al Corby and his security people that was illegal in Hollywood? And remember on my Sprint phone about, what, 19 years ago or however many years ago it was, I made a video and they communicated that it was Al Corby that was burning my front teeth. And they even said that Al Corby used to work for Bob and Tom Radio in Indianapolis. I'm not sure if he did or not, but... If any of his people have been burning me with satellites, Al Corby has to get arrested. Or anybody that's been burning me with satellites. I'm not playing your game, man. I went through this shit when I was a little boy when they murdered my father. These people tried to burn on me. They they were burning on me and my mother. My mother is richer than any man in this country. I'm the owner of my mother and father's estates. And I was in the movie Diving In with uh, Tom, I guess it was. He was in the movie... The blonde-haired guy, he was in the movie Diving In. It's a water movie, a swimming movie, and Matt Latanzi was in the movie. Alan Thicke was in it, and uh, a few other people. And uh, this point of information is basic information. You know, I wore Speedo trunks in the movie, too. It was a diving movie about swimmers. And they even used some of my mother's property in Indianapolis, didn't they? You know, the uh, condo building up on 86th Street, is that one of my mother's buildings? It was in the film, too, you know. And uh, Matt Latanzi is uh, Olivia Newton-John's ex-husband or something. I guess they're ex. They're not together anymore. But in reference to this, I like man just hit my teeth just now. I don't care who you think you people are in Hollywood. I own the deeds to my mother and father's companies, properties, and land. Anybody that's tried to hurt me, any person that's blocked me from my mother and father's mansions, or blocked me from any of my properties. You're blackballed from Beverly Hills, Bel Air, Rodeo Drive, and everywhere else, man. That's what I said. Well, who's gonna... What about these people that rent from your property? No, no, no. See, I, I don't give a fuck about that shit. If you're blocking me from my mother and father's mansions, I don't care if you're a renter down the fucking street. If you're blocking me from my mother and father's mansions, you're gonna have to fucking move out of Beverly Hills and Bel Air. No matter who the fuck you are. I don't give a fuck what you think. I don't care about your imaginary fabrications of the shit your people tried to make up. I've never been a bad person. I've never had a criminal record. And your people blocked me from my mother and father's mansions and made up accusations against me. Was Al Corby involved in the murder of Doris Duke? Was Al Corby involved in the murder of Jack Warner? Was Al Corby involved in the murder of Walt Disney? Was Jack uh, was uh, Al Corby involved in the murder of uh, Nelson Rockefeller? Was Al Corby involved in the murder of uh, Howard Hughes? This is very important. Everybody knows Al Corby was tied in with the FBI and the CIA of the Nazi Party, and some people think that Al Corby's a Middle Eastern German, and he was faking his ethnicity and nationality. Al Corby needs to go into court. And he must get prosecuted for any crimes or any physical assault that he or any of his people have ever fucking done to me out in public or in private. And if he stole any of my sperm or if he claimed he was protecting any of these females that stole sperm from me and they were holding on to monies from my mother, Al Corby can get put on trial for execution and life in prison. And so can any female in Hollywood conspiring against me. Or anybody that conspired against my mother or father. Lots of things of importance, man. You all can go on TV. You can all go on uh, YouTube and make all your arguments. You can say all your arguments. I'm going to give you your freedom of speech in this subject of information. But you better be able to back it up. You make up lies on me. Or you slander my character. Or you've damaged my face or teeth. You better say it. And you better turn yourself in so you can go to prison. You better leave me alone. I'm not playing with you, man. My face is my face. My teeth are my teeth. You don't have no right damaging nothing on my body, man. You don't have no right trying to force me to go buy cigarettes either. So in reverence to this, what they're trying to do, too. And in reverence to, uh, they're burning across my upper lip right here. Now, which person has a mustache in Hollywood or in security companies? 
You think you have a right burning on my beautiful skin? Do you think your skin DNA is what? You thought you had connections to my upper lip, man? Go ahead, say anything you want to say. Be very real to back it up on YouTube, man. Raw protocol of my identity is in the media. I am not playing with you or any of your people. I'm warning you about touching my teeth, man. I'm fucking warning you, man. You think you're the, you people think you're the king of Hollywood? You think you're the king of Bel Air or Beverly Hills government, man? Is that what you think, Mr. Satellite Man? You think you're the king of America? We need to check your DNA. See where you fucking come from, man. You better leave me alone. You better quit burning my face and teeth, man. 